All right, let's learn how to make money with tax certificates. Would you like to do that? Yes. All right, now you might want to write a couple of notes as I go along. Tell you a little story about my friend. He lives, o he lives over in Arizona. His name is Dave, and, I, and Dave called me on the phone. He said, Ted, I just put $2,000 in the bank. How much? $2, I said, well, great. Why'd you do that? And he said, well, Ted, I'm 35 today, and I want to retire when I'm 55. I said, okay, I got it. I said, well, what are you going to do? He said, well, I'm going to put $2,000 in the bank. I said, well, what is your bank paying? Now, we all know banks pay 1%. He said, oh, my bank's going to pay me 3.75. I said, no way, 3.75. He said, no, I got a special deal with the bank. I said, okay. All right, so you're going to put 2000 in the bank and you're going to get 3.75. Have I got it? He said, yeah. I said, all right, last question. What is your money going to be worth in the 20 years when you want to retire? He said, I don't know. And see, that's the problem. Most people don't have a clue on what their retirement is going to be. So I said, okay, Dave, let's figure out what the $2,000 is going to be worth. Because this is going to be his retirement, right? I said, okay. So in a little calculator, a little handheld calculator, I put $2,000. You can do it on your cell phone. $2,000 at 16%. That's what I paid in Arizona, if you remember, okay? I said, $2,000 at 16%. And I found out what it was for one year. And then I just reiterated it for the next 19 years. Everybody understand what I did? Okay, so I just kept rolling it over. And... Uh, I said to him, Dave, are you, are you, do you have any idea what this the money is going to be worth? He said, I don't have any idea, but I just know I want to get retired in, in 20 years. And I said, okay. So $2,000 invested, 16%. I reiterated it. So I did it for the whole 20 years. His $2,000 is going to be worth a whopping, woo-hoo! <sighs> How's his retirement doing? I mean, the way things are going, the inflation and all that, that's probably about two tanks of gas in 20 years, don't you think? <laughs> wow. He said, Ted, that doesn't look good. I said, no, it doesn't, Dave. He said, what should I do? I said, well, you're talking to the tax lien guy. I said, why don't you put that? Now, when I rolled it over, I said I put it in 16, but I made a mistake. I put $2,000 in, and I put it in at 3.75, which is what he was at. So I, I said, Dave, why don't you buy some certificates in the state of Arizona, which pays 16%. He said, can I do that? I said, yeah, you can either do them on the internet or you could buy them, you could just go ahead and raise your hand and buy those certificates. He said, okay, so take the $2,000 in and buy those certificates and earn 16%. I said, that's exactly right. He said, well, how much will that be worth in 20 years? And I said, okay, so I put in the calculator, $2,000, 16%, rolled it over, and sure enough, at the end of 20 years, his money is now gonna be worth, ho ho. Is that a little better? Which one do you want? He said, Ted, wow. He said, I didn't know they were this good. And I said, well, nobody else does either. You see, what the problem is, is you guys are scared to death. And I know you're scared to death because when you make an investment, you're afraid you're going to lose the money. I know that. Everybody's scared. This one won't let you down because you're not investing with a broker. You're not investing in some real estate. You're investing with who? And your check's coming back from? And so this one is not going to let you down. So let's just take it to another level, because I'm just showing you fourth grade math. Fourth grade math. So I said, Dave, let's go for the gold. Let's go to Maryland or Iowa. Iowa pays 24%. You guys probably wrote that down. So I said, with the calculator, I said, let's put $2,000, because that's what he was going to invest. And now let's invest it at 24%. How much? 24%. And we'll find out one year, and then we'll reiterate it for a few more years. Would that be good? He said, yeah, what would my $2,000 be worth? Well, we started out with $4,000. We jumped it up to $30,000. Now let's take a look at how sophisticated and how good a tax lien could really be. <laughs> now we're talking about Donald Trump kind of money. How much money did I invest? How many times did I do it? And all I kept doing with it was what? Oh, my God. Now, this is going to give you what's called hope. <laughs> Put that down on your piece of paper, because some of you don't have hope. And you want some hope, because you're worried about the future. I know why you're here. I come from your seat. And you'll see that in a minute. I've been all the way on the bottom, and I'm not there anymore. And I got out of it doing what I'm telling you. All right, how much money did I invest? Total investment, please. 
And if I did it at 24%, ask yourself, don't ask me, should you be doing this? Boy, did it get quiet in here. Oh my God, this guy's showing it. So I promised you I'd do that in the first 20 minutes or so. So, $2,000 investment at 24% is $120,000. You see, there's not a person in here that can't afford to do this. If you had $165 a month at the end of the year, you'd have $2,000. You could get started in the next 12 months if you only had $165 a month. If you start earning the right rent, you go to the bank and make 1%, is that going to do you much good? Probably not. But if you learn how to do it on the web and start making 24%, would that make a difference? Okay, I can't make you rich by Friday, but I can make you what? I could give you a lot of H-O-P-E, right? It'd be nice to have some of that, wouldn't it? Yes, it'd be real nice to have some of that. Okay, let's read that to yourselves, please. Raise your hand when you finish reading. Hmm. Okay, I'll, I'll do it again for the slow readers. Just a minute. <laughs> okay, boom, boom. Raise your hand when you got it. When you got it? Everybody got it? <laughs> okay, well, you got to have a little fun. Otherwise, you kind of go crazy with this job. Let me tell you. I'll be thinking that about 3 o'clock in the morning when I'm driving back to Orlando, so I'm going to get on the airplane. All right. How would it be if you had 300000 Make a difference? Would you like me to show you how to do that? Okay, I'm an anti-risk guy. You don't know this, but I don't like risk. I do not like risk. You, everyone in this room will take more risk than I will. I'm not in the risk business. I'm going to teach you to stay out of the risk business. Okay, now you can do anything you want, but I teach people how to stay out of the risk business. So we're going to do this together. Is that good? Okay, raise your hand if it's $300,000 to make a difference. Everybody in the room. Okay, all right, we're going to do this together, all right? What I want you to do is I want you to reinvent yourself, and I'm going to show you how to do it right now. I want you to yell it out. I want you to invest how much money? For how many years? Okay, that's a total of? Man, are you guys good at math? Wow, you're really good. All right, watch me. Watch my hands. Okay, I got $10,000. It goes all the way up to the ceiling. Everybody sees the 10000 yes? Okay, now we're going to go to Iowa, and we're going to invest that money. Because Iowa paid how much? 24%. Okay, now every time those certificates pay off, we're going to reinvest the money. What are we going to do with that? Okay, so that's kind of roll it over, isn't it? Okay. All right, now if we don't get paid on one of those, then we're going to get the... And we could just roll that amount over too, couldn't we? All right. So the amount of money I'm shooting for was how much? Who remembers? Everybody remember 300? You all agree? All right, well, let's see how we did on that, okay? Because, we, because sometimes I'm not so good on math. But let's see how we did, okay? So just to review, we invested $10,000. Now, some of you already have $10,000 right now. If you don't have $10,000, you could borrow it, or you could do, the, do a slower process and just do a few thousand dollars a year. But the point is, if you had $10,000, let's see what we can turn that $10,000 into. And we're trying to get how much money, everyone? $300,000. Okay, well, we did the whole thing, and actually it's going to come out to be... Um, come out to be... Come out to be, woo! Count of three will say, oh my God. One, two, three. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the number. Okay, now close your eyes and think about that number. Now, while your eyes are closed, go ahead and close them just for a second. Just play along with me. Have a little fun. Turn, the, turn it to red. Just look at it. No, now look at it red. Keep your eyes closed and look at it red. Don't look at me. Look at the screen. Whatever. All right, turn it blue. Is that a pretty good looking number? Yeah, okay, you can open your eyes again. All right. How much money did I invest? Hello? Oh, my God, Ted Thomas. <sighs> How would you feel? Who's a pretty good? You're just pretty good? Yeah, just, getting just getting started. I like that. That's a good attitude, right? Just getting started. All right. So you guys should feel good, yes? yes. Everyone, yes? yes? Okay, yes. Okay. What would your family say? When's he going to die? <laughs> yeah? Huh? Hi, I'm Ted. I'm Maxine. Hi. You know, it's, I, I feel bad because you missed the free trip to Hawaii. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Maxine? Yes? Everybody say, hi, Maxine, you're late. <laughs> no, no, you're not supposed to say. Just 
we're having fun and you missed the fun, see? Okay, here we go. So, what, what would your family say? Just say it to yourself. Don't say it out loud because it might not be a good thing to say. <laughs> all right, all right. So, would you have a little security in your life? Okay, so what I'm teaching you is I'm showing the foundation. We got that, yes? Now we've learned how to buy these certificates. Have I spent a lot of money? No. We spent a little bit of money, but we made a what? And that's what kind of investment you want to make. Okay, have I asked you to take a risk? No. See, it's not even my vocabulary. It's a four-letter word. I don't even have it. I don't have that. I don't want to take any risk. I'm investing my money with the... You guys got it, okay? All right. So basically what I've taught you so far is the power of money. And if you did that in your IRA, it would be tax deductible. Every person in this room, 20 years ago now, could have a half a million dollars. I just showed you how to do it, and I only invested $10,000. I invested $10,000 and showed you how to make a half a million dollars. You've never seen a demonstration like that in your life. And that is fourth grade math. Fourth grade math. You go out and check what I ta taught you today. Start out at the very basic level. Start with a $2,000 investment. You're going to have a half a million dollars. That's a lot of money. That will make a whole different life for you. You'd be not only feeling good inside, you'd be looking good on the outside. You'll be feeling good because you got some money. It's not a dream, it's real. Everything I showed you was fourth grade math. Do you like it so far? Yes. Should you have learned this five years ago?